Understanding Impact Wrench, a tool in language and mechanics. Hello everyone, welcome to our English learning series. Today, we're going to explore a very specific term, impact wrench. This phrase is not just about language, but also about understanding a tool used in various mechanical contexts. Let's dive into what this phrase means and how it's used in both language and practice. An impact wrench is a power tool commonly used for loosening or tightening bolts and nets. It's a handy tool in automotive repair, construction, and heavy equipment maintenance. The key feature of an impact wrench is its ability to provide high torque output with minimal exertion by the user. This makes it a preferred tool in scenarios where manual wrenches would require a lot more effort and time. In English, the term impact wrench can be broken down into two parts. Impact refers to a sudden force or collision. In the case of the tool, it refers to the sudden jolt of force applied to turn bolts and nuts. Wrench, on the other hand, is a tool used for gripping and turning objects. Therefore, an impact wrench is a tool that combines these two functions, applying a sudden force to turn something. The impact wrench is not a common household tool, but it's vital in certain industries. Mechanics often use it to remove lug nuts from car wheels quickly. It's also seen in construction sites for assembling large structures, Understanding the context where this tool is used can help learners grasp the practical significance of the term. To understand impact wrench better, it's helpful to compare it with similar tools. For instance, a regular wrench requires manual force and doesn't provide the same power as an impact wrench. Another similar tool is the drill, but it's primarily used for making holes. Unlike the impact wrench, which is used for turning bolts and nuts. I hope this video has helped clarify what an impact wrench is and how it's used both as a term and a tool. Remember, learning a language also involves understanding the context and usage of terms in real life. Stay curious and keep learning. See you in our next video.